Hello and welcome to webmastercampus.com. In this tutorial, we are going to see how to use wildcard in classes using CSS. Okay, let's get started. So I'm going to create a index.html file. Okay, close the explorer, write down the HTML and h1. I'm let's paste the code that we are going to use in this one and I'm going to use live server. Okay, so use CS wildcard in classes. To implement the wildcard, I am going to write down a first, let's create the style and in which I will write the style and let's create a UL. Inside of this UL, we will have a class and this class, let's call the list item and list item is a class and content will be, let's say item dash dollar dollar it will create the uh, incremental sequence of numbers and then i'm going to paste this okay so here we are with the uh, a ul structure and if i'm going to use a dot uh, list item and i'm going to change this just the color and it's handy you can see that all the li colors have been changed okay this is perfectly fine and we can also use something like this let's say li class and uh, in this class i'm going to say where a list item is available inside of li change the content of that class to color let's take something else blue and okay and i'm going to remove this one okay just remove the space and it will start working then you can say the color have been changed still but uh, this is a common example but let's see we have got the requirement where uh, class names are different and we still need to apply any rule to this one how are you gonna use this you can use the wildcard so one of the possibility is use the carrot symbol shift 6 will add this carrot symbol or reverse v style in this and it, you can see it is again started working why because it, this is checking if there is any class that is starting with the list item so if there is any class with the starting name is a list item it will apply all this so in their names are different but this is fulfill the rule that all the classes are starting with list item but let's say we just want to apply the css where item is listed not the complete list item again when we do this it will remove it the blue color okay how we gonna fix this instead of use this carrot now you we need to use the static symbol and once you use the static it means apply to all where you find this word even inside of a class name okay so this is how we can apply uh, a wild cause to in css classes thank you for watching this video please like and subscribe my channel